So I was just running around over here and I spooked an entire herd of Grados like down that way. And I looked up and this dude's just like walking right at me. So uh, before he decides to go with his herd, I think we're gonna try to take him. He looks big to me. Like I'm actually maybe more confident that that could be a diamond than any of the level five Grados I've shot so far. And there's been a few. So I'm at least pretty hopeful on this one. Like something looked bigger about that one. Oh my goodness. Okay, uh, let's go claim this. It should be move laundering time for a bit yet. But I just like turned around because this is where I was going. I was going that way. And there's that. So uh, let's see what we can end up getting out of this little trip to this lake. So this is hopefully a diamond. 972. He's potentially like bigger horns then. Like, bigger than what a 950 would be. So, maybe I could actually see that. It annoys me the way they, like, tilt. We'll get that as a screenshot. We'll send that to the lodge. So, finally now, after I don't know how many level 5s we shot, we actually are on our way to getting a diamond grand slam mount. And now, let's go see what the heck this guy is. Oh, I got a little closer than I meant to there. I was trying to figure out where they were. I was looking at a bunch more Ibex, but potentially if we can get over here, and I'd like them to be broadside. If you guys have seen uh, some of the struggles I've had on the move lawn, like in the beta and in the live game, you'll know why. Oh gosh, game just got super framey there. I was afraid it was gonna crash, uh, but he's still facing me for now. I don't know. I mean, you can also shoot them like single lung frontal and be good because the the thing that i'm most afraid of is shooting like above the heart and between the lungs i managed to do that in very uh inopportune times that one looks big too that's just a big four but uh yeah i mean getting much closer the brush ends up hiding them so maybe i'll take that shot i mean it is a mouflon it's reasonably common to find level fives and he could even be too small Let's try it. Just try to keep that like in the side of his chest. And honestly, I have no idea. Uh, there's hunting pressure there, and I don't think I had any on my map there, so we should be good. I don't even know why I'm taking that shot, but I, I took enough broadside shots and messed them up that I might as well try something different, I guess. Why are there so many huge-looking mouflon down here? They all look like diamonds to me, but I want to see if I can get his weight. Yeah, he died. I mean, right there, so. Definitely no problems on the quick kill. And we might just be going in blind, because I don't see any footprints. Oh, there's one down there, but I think we'll just go for it. I've had a 939. I've had a messed up one on Twitch. And now we have a 979 diamond. That's actually... If you saw... I think it was on YouTube that it happened. There was a diamond move on on the beta where I dropped it, the game crashed, I went back to get it, and then I shot it in the vertebrae. This is the exact score of what that should have been, so that is just about fitting for our first diamond mouflon in the live game. And again, they do that, they're like tilting, I don't understand why. And yeah, that single long shot, no problem. So we got our Grand Slam started, and now we have a multi-mount for the mouflon of wolf started. I know there's a mission. I'm not going to spoil anything. I know there's a mission that can help me with that. That's all I'll say. Um, and then otherwise, we should still need some other ones. So maybe we'll do some wolf hunting at some point. So that's where my five got to. I spotted one like fleeing up this hill. I think they spooked from a zone somewhere down in here. And he's just walking in place there. Like I don't have... I don't have access to the the time or anything on this server so I'm probably gonna try to shoot it I'm just a little bit afraid because he is kind of jumping back and forth or did he stop I think it just looks like he's stopping but I'll try to wait it out a minute here and see if anything happens and if not I guess we'll just try to go for it I mean we got a diamond mouflon earlier in the video so 
I suppose it's not a big deal. We we already got one that's like not stuck. But he doesn't look like he's doing anything. So let's keep this like right there ish looks safe. And honestly, it's the 30 odd stick, so we can maybe even stay a little bit extra back. Whatever we hit, that worked pretty good. But yeah, uh, I had that happen with that Grados Ibex yesterday. And I really didn't want to have to try to reset everything. Ooh. 59.55. That should be quite a large feather. Now, I don't know if he's got bigger horns than the one we just killed a couple hours ago. Or a couple of minutes ago for you guys watching. But I did think as he was running away, he maybe looked bigger. So I'll try to compare the two of them in the lodge. Kind of tough to tell when you can only see one of his horns. But this guy is a 991 diamond. So he's probably high trophy rating. I would say. And look at the Truex. Check this out. So this side curls all the way basically into his face. It might just be phasing through it slightly. And that side's way over there. That is cool. That is really, really cool. I love that. That's 100% going to be the one I use in my in my multi-mount that I mentioned, but... Yeah. I, was I saying something else? Oh, the, the trophy rating thing. When they max at 60, like, half a kilo is a lot. So I'm just guessing that's actually quite high, but I will take that all day. That is the coolest thing, the way that curls in like that. I really like it. So that was kind of my goal for today, just to kind of play multiplayer and see if we could get some stuff added to the trophy lodge, and we actually got some some pretty nice additions. So, uh, we can take this guy down, because we've improved our Grados to an actual diamond. Uh, if I can click the right thing. And, I mean, eventually he's going to go in the Grand Slam multi-mount, but for now he's going to fit there. And then, I think, I mean, the two Mouflon might just I think that's going to look good right inside the doorway. So we got our 991 with that really neat true rack. I really like that, the way that curls in. I want to have it probably facing that way so you can see it as you come in. And then we got the other one there. And we'll just have it face straight, I think. But yeah, that was a good little multiplayer session. I mean, the diamond mouflon, as far as I can tell, are fairly common. So that's not really a big deal. But getting the diamond grados and getting a, a pretty solid score out of him in the 970s, I think that's probably uh, what I'm most happy about after that, because I've just had so many <laughs> Ibex that trolling me at level 5, so that was good to actually get one on the board. And like I said, actually starting to make some progress towards the uh, Grand Slam multi-mount. So, uh, yeah, I still have that albino one to go for. I saw an albino uh, southeastern Ibex, but it was a female, and I just let it go. Uh, so maybe we can get that done in the next few days, but anyway... I think that is going to do it for this video. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time.